Staging cancer is an important component for diagnostic and treatment planning. The general way of staging cancer is using the TNM staging system. T relates to the size of the primary tumour, N relates to the extent of lymph node involvement, and M relates to the evidence of metastasis or spread to a secondary site, sometimes known as secondary tumours. The information from the TNM system can then manifest into the four stage outcomes. Now, using breast cancer as an example, starting with the T staging system, firstly TX means the doctor was unable to assess for the tumour, a T0 means there's no evidence for a tumour in the breast, a T1 means that the tumour is approximately two centimetres or less. A T2 means that the tumour is two to five centimetres in size. A T3 means that the tumour is five centimetres or greater. Or T4 means the tumour size can be of any size, but has moved into either the skin or the chest wall. Moving to the nodes or the N, NX means that the doctor was unable to assess for nodal involvement. N0 means that there's no evidence of lymph nodes involved. N1, 2, and 3, as the number increases, it means that the cancer has involved more numbers, but also has spread to a more distant sites, such as the axillary or the armpit and beyond. Finally, the M, or metastasis, refers to has the tumour spread to secondary sites in the bottom body. MX refers to the doctor cannot assess for metastasis. M0, there's no evidence for metastasis. And M1 is there is evidence for a distant site spread to a secondary site, such as liver, lung, brain, and bone. Finally, how does this system manifest into the four stages? Stage one means the tumor is relatively small, but there's no evidence of nodal involvement or metastasis. Stage two, the tumor is getting to a larger size and there may be a small number of nodes involved, but no metastasis. Stage three, the tumor is getting quite large or even may manifest into the wall or the skin. The increased number of node involvement, but no metastasis. And stage four, the tumor has now moved into distant sites.